Hello, my name is Johnny. Welcome to another World War II 172 vehicle. <clears throat> We're going to look at uh, something unusual, more of a what if Panzer uh, that would have come out by 1946. Uh, if you'd like, please subscribe, hit that notification bell, like, reply, and share. Uh, this is a plastic models. This was a two pack kit by Pegasus brand models. Uh, this is a Vehicle, I believe they call it an E10 type, and this is the Jagarundi, or the, that's the name they put on it there, the package, and it would be a very small uh, replacement for the Hetzer like vehicle. It would have the 75 millimeter uh, standard size, not the long gun on it, and then it had an all around little open turret with a, a machine gun in it. Uh, painted up in uh, like an ambush style camouflage. Show the bottom, the gray. This was uh, a simple type uh, kit, not that many parts per uh, model doing it. And it was a two pack. And you can see you got two different uh, numbers on there the decals. So, like I said, this would be for, like, if you were continuing on the war, 1945, 1946, they were planning on simplifying their designs, and they had, the, like, E-50s, E-75s that would replace the King Tiger and so far, and even larger vehicles, but this would be the smaller one. So, this would be a tank hunter. Very low to the ground. Very sloped. So even with thinner armor at this slope, it would be effective at uh, <clears throat> defeating some of the shells. Uh, very neat indeed. So like I said, a, a cleaned up uh, idea of uh, the Hetzer design, but on a purpose-built vehicle with simpler road wheels and so forth that uh, they could just manufacture in different sizes. Until next time. More World War II, 172 scale. Thank you for watching.